Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up a new user account on your Mac operating system. So let's get started and let's see how we can set up a new user account on our Mac. So what you need to do is you need to just click on this Apple icon here and then click on system preferences. So I'm going to just click on system preferences, which is going to open this system preferences window. And here, what you need to do is you need to search for users and groups. Okay, so search for users and group and click on that uh, icon. And then you will be able to see this kind of window which says users and groups on the top. And you can see right now I have only one user who is a admin user, which is me. And I want to create a new user account. So let's see how we can do it. So for creating a new user account, you just need to click on this lock icon here, which says click the lock icon to make changes, which is going to ask you for your max password. So I'm going to provide my max password. This is the same password which I use to log into Mac, right? So click on lock. And once you do that, you will be able to see this button will be activated. So in order to just add a new user, you might have guessed it by now. You just need to click this uh, plus button here. And then you will be able to see this kind of interface. Now here on new account section, you will be able to see several options here. So you can see admin, standard, then you will see managed with parental control and sharing only and groups, right? So what are all these options? So admin is an administrator and administrator can add and manage other users, install apps on the Mac or change settings. Now standard users are the users which are set by administrator and standard users can install and change their own settings, but they can't add other users or they can't change the settings of other users. The third option here is the managed parental control. This you might want to uh, create when you want to create an account for your kids and you might want to have a parental control. The last option here is the share only and share only users can access shared files remotely, but they can't log in to or change settings on your computer. You will also see this groups option and a group allows multiple users to have the same access privileges. So in my case, I want to uh, create a standard user who can just have his login access, but he can't uh, create any other users, right? So standard user can be a guest user or if you want to create a new user for your family or friends, right? And then here in this section, it's obvious you can give the name to your user. I will just name it as user2, for example. Here also, I will just leave it as default. User2, you can change this uh, name with the different name. Here you can give the password to the new user and this password you can provide to the new user so he can log in. I will verify my password and the password hint, I will just give uh, any text here. Here you might want to add a text which will help the user to remember his password or you can remember the password. And then I will just create on a create user button which is going to create a new user for my Mac operating system. So you can see this new user is created. So when I click on this user two option, here I can see uh, this checkbox, which will allow this user, user two, to administer this computer. Also, this will allow or enable parental control. And from here, you can reset the password of the new user. So now once you have created the new user, once you log out of your Mac operating system, you will see two users. One is the admin user, and then you will see the other users which you have created. 
So this is how you can set up a new user account on your Mac operating system. I hope you have enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.